Hello, my name is Abrea Lewis and I'm a health communication specialist. I also work part-time as a college advisor and I'm the founder of a nonprofit organization called PO Purpose, which stands for Pursuit of Purpose. As a health communication specialist, I work with the CDC to create health resources and education materials to help people understand how to prevent disease. Sometimes that means I get to be really creative and partner with organizations in, in different ways. So one way is by working with the entertainment industry, and sometimes I can put or help to incorporate some health messaging into some of your favorite television shows or even games, and that's really cool. As a college advisor, I work with students just like you to help you understand and navigate the college application process. As the founder of a nonprofit organization, I donate and raise money to help empower minority students to pursue their purpose through education. My career journey has not been a straight one. It has not been linear at all. So I started a college uh, at Duke University and with the intention to become a doctor. As that went along, I realized that I wasn't interested in being a general pre-med student. Biology did not interest me and neither did chemistry. So I decided to create my own major. I titled it Visualizing Medicine, the Role of the Media in Health Communication. Through that major, I was able to understand more about the role of the entertainment industry in really educating people and also the importance of health communication. And by the way, I watched tons of Grey's Anatomy in undergrad, and that really contributed to this whole venture. <laughs> After I graduated Duke, I knew that I wanted to learn more about public health, but I wasn't quite ready to do that yet. More school was not necessarily on my mind. So I decided to become a college advisor for a year, and I served a school in the same city that I went to undergrad in. That was important to me because I had college advisors whenever I was in high school and that was very helpful to help me understand how to navigate the college applications process. So I wanted to give back to students in the same way that I was poured into. I've always seen the benefit in giving back whenever you are able to. Um, after I finished college advising for a year, I went back to school and got my master's in public health at Emory University. Then I got my job as a health communication specialist. While I do that, as you know, part-time, I'm still a college advisor. What I love most about my work is that it's meaningful. I feel like I'm doing something that I'm actually passionate about and that is for a specific reason. I'm able to work for people who you know, need this information. I'm able to share what I know with people and, and that's important to me. It's basically giving back. Public health was something that I didn't really know about whenever I first went to college. I think now a lot more people probably know about what public health is after we're, we just went through a pandemic and we're still in it, you know? Whenever I was in college, I was exposed to a bunch of different pre-health opportunities and I wanted to go into the realm that spoke to my strengths and my interests. One thing I want to express to everyone is that you should always show up as yourself in every space that you occupy. Be you intentionally and don't let anyone shine or don't let anyone dim your light. And finally, I have one other piece of advice for you. Closed mouths don't get fed. I know that's not advice, right? But it's, it's something that we hear a lot, but it is true. If there's ever an opportunity that you want to take advantage of or a specific route or something that you wanna do, um, you should speak up about it. So many doors will open at that point. Room will be made for you to be able to do what you wanna do and to be able to do that authentically as yourself. You are the best person to do the work that you want to do and people want to let you shine your light. I promise if you do that, you'll feel successful in whatever it is that you wanna do.